Yo, what's good, everyone? It's your boy Shady C here, and I want to make a response to uh, Double Z TV's "I Pay for My Slam Crate" video. Would you like an applause? You get one for free. And first, let me say I enjoy his videos; they're very entertaining. But as a YouTuber who pays for everything I unbox on this channel, pays for everything. It annoys the shit out of me when you've got YouTubers getting shit for free. And not only that, there's YouTubers who get free WrestleMania tickets from Seat Geek, I think it's called. Seat Geek, Seat Nerd, Seat, Seat Something. And it makes me wonder. These people literally expect everything for free. I'm serious. I can imagine the YouTubers, Double Z TV included, calling their uh, electric company. Yeah, I'm a YouTuber. Can I get a free month? Or, or calling their phone company. Yeah, I'm a YouTuber. Can I get a free month? Everyone throws free crap at me. Okay, you pay. maybe you pay for the slam crate. I'll give you an applause if my hand was free. No, wait a minute. You know what? I'm going to give you an applause. Here we go. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to set this up. But let's be honest. Every other crate you get... Every other subscription box you get, you get for free. I wouldn't be shocked if the be shop doesn't send you free shit. Any YouTuber over a thousand subs gets shit handed to them for free. I'll make. I'll tell you what. I could end up with a million subs. I wouldn't take free shit because I have some sort of inner self worth, some sort of inner self esteem. I don't believe in getting shit handed to you like that. So. I'm at a loss for words. That's right. You have got give, put Shady C at a loss for words. He's sitting there and he's like, well, I get two. I get one for free and I pay for one. Okay. And I guarantee all of you, now that his partnership with Slam Crate is done, you won't see any more Slam Crate unboxings. I'm, I guarantee it. Watch. Watch. He said his last one was his last um, partnership. The, the partnership's ending. The only way you'll see more is if for some reason the partnership continues. Because I'll tell you what. I'll tell you a little story. I commented on one of his videos. I said, dude, they're coming out with an official WWE crate. Are you getting it? And he said, no, I'm not going to get it. Because initially he wasn't a partner. He didn't decide to get it until he became a partner. Do I necessarily buy this whole two crate thing? I don't know. Maybe they send him two to make it look like he bought one. I don't know. I really don't fucking know, to be honest with you. But I guarantee if the partnership ends, you won't see another WWE Slam Crate unboxing video. I don't do them anymore, but because the shirts are too small. I'm a big guy. You know, it gets annoying when I wear a 4X and they only go up to a 3X. That's the only reason I stopped doing it. The only reason. I like having a shirt that fits well. For example, this shirt fits decently, but it shrank. It shrunk. It doesn't cover the bottom of my stomach. I don't want to walk out like that. I don't feel the need to do that. People do do that. I've seen fat people walk out with their stomach exposed. I don't think that's necessarily an attractive sight from a man. So I don't do that. If you notice, the camera only goes to a certain... I, I'm not, Yeah, not, not going to show the bottom of my shirt. But um, this is for around the house. But it does annoy me. If they had them available in 4X, would I get it? Yeah, I would. Sure, why not? I actually recently resubscribed to WrestleCrate, getting their cheapest package possible, only because they have so much indie shit. And if you've looked at my comments on different YouTubers unboxings, um, I used to get Slam uh, WrestleCrate. You can look back. There, there. I, I think I got the first four or five. The first WrestleCrate was amazing. It had a WWE anthology DVD in there. That was really cool. It was a majority of WWE box. So I thought, okay, this is what it's going to be. But it ended up mostly being indie crap. I don't care about the indie crap. I don't want a Ring of Honor DVD. But anyways, that's my little mini rant on that. But, um... No, it just it has always annoyed me that YouTubers, big YouTubers, 
care about their subscribers so little that they don't want to invest any actual money into their channel. <clears throat> Think about it this way. Think about it this way. You've got YouTubers right now who, after the whole, you know, YouTube scandal with um, the advertising, the money's drying up. You got YouTubers out there saying, ah, I'm probably going to make less videos. Why? It takes no effort to make a video. You hit record. You don't have to spend any money on that. <laughs> but what you spend money on is things like unboxings and whatnot. You know, make the content interesting. Give them something to look at. Maybe you buy a game if you're a gamer. Like, I do some gaming videos. But no. Most YouTubers... Most YouTubers won't invest any actual money into the YouTube. They just want to make money. See me? I do this for fun. If I end up making money, that's cool. That's nice. But you ask someone, would you still do this if there was no chance of making money? Most of them would, no, I wouldn't. Or they would lie and say they would. And then something like this YouTube advertising thing comes out and the videos dry up. I would still do it. I enjoy it. It's fun. I like giving my opinion on things. I enjoy showing people things I buy. For example, if you look back at the very last one I did, it was um, the last unboxing I did. It was a pair of earphones. Didn't get them for free. Paid for them. Last thing I unboxed before that. Didn't get it for free. Paid for it. Everything you see me unbox in here, I, won't, I, do, I, get, I don't get for free. I pay for it. But let's be honest here. Hypothetically, I could have every crate subscription box company email me right now. Say, hey, we want you to be a partner. We'll send you free stuff. No, thank you. I'd take the link, but tell them to keep their free stuff. Because I know that my channel is worth more than that. It's worth more than unboxing free shit. <clears throat> but anyways, if you agree with me, like the video, subscribe, and share. If you don't agree with me, you're wrong. Like, subscribe, and share. Post your comments down below. Do you think I'm wrong? Why am I wrong? Do you agree with me? But remember... This is Shady C, and I'm always right.